Alright everyone, hello, and this is part 17 of my Dungard walkthrough. Uh, there you go, all yes. the keepers are destroyed. Uh, blah blah blah. Dunavir, we will find out who he is. Uh, now we've got to follow uh, Mother Vampire, who is Mother of Daughter Vampire, who is there with a Dragon Priest mask on. And now we are entering something called the Boneyard. Uh, I have no idea what to expect. Uh, for all I know, I could be ambushed by a very scary dragon who wants to bite my fish off. Uh, you never know, it could be the soul of the dragon that tried to eat my friend the wizard who cured me of my vampirism. Uh, I believe that was on episode 9 where that happened. Uh... Yeah, so as I slowly decide to follow this vampire with Princess Leia hair, uh, I'm going to call him Mother Leia from now on. Mother Leia and uh, Evil Butterfly Priest. Slay Dernavir. Who's Dernavir? Ah! Well, the fun what Dernavir is. He's a very angry looking dragon. Who shoots God? What the hell is does he shoot at me? This is like a ripoff of Fable 3. So he did something like this in Fable 3. It's like some weird blue light which causes weird skeletons to rise from the ground. Uh, right, where's this Dernavir? I can't even see him. Oh, he's not even there. Quickly! Attack! Where's he flying off to? Come on, Dunavir. He has a very, very, very interesting name, I have to admit. Alright, looks like we've got more bone men on their way to try and kill. And I have arrows to assist in their death. That just failed miserably. Uh, oh, hello, he's down on the ground. We could see the death of Dernavir. We have the death of Dernavir! Well, that's uh, dragon hunting in Solcairn. For what the hell is wrong with him? All right, I seem to be absorbing uh, something. Oh no! Wow, I don't absorb this dragon. Okay, strange. Well, so that's doing to be a dead, or is that like a hologram of him, or whatever? Okay. Volumes written on Dernavir allege that he can't be slain by normal means. It appears that. Yeah, because he's not Alduin. The soul of a dragon is as resilient as its owner's sleep. It's possible that your killing blow has merely displaced Dernavir's physical form while he reconstitutes himself. Oh, okay, so he's not dead. Minutes, hours, years. I can't even. Okay, what's with the long pause, love? Come on, he's leading us to the scroll. Follow me, this way. Okay. Now give me the frickin' scroll. Come on, he's leading us to the scroll. Scroll! But I never thought... Oh, for Christ's sake. Go on. Blah, blah, blah. Now, let's get you the Elder Scroll. Thank you. he's leading us to the scroll. Ah, oh, is it in that chest? So it's not going to be some epic thing that makes it arrive. It's just a simple, oh look, it's going to open, now take it. What did you want? That's it. That's the last scroll. Come on, let's take it again. What is she doing? I want to read this Elder Scroll. See what happens. Blood. 
Read the scroll. Now that you've retrieved the elf scroll, there's anything I can do before you depart. You must let me know. So my daughter applied some of the lessons I taught her about don't worry. I think I can help you. Your soul essence was trapped inside a gem. When you and Savannah enter the soul, you simply need to retrieve the gem. The moment you... There's an offer. Is there anything else? I have no choice. Oh. If I return to Tamriel, that increases how far it's likely to bring the tyranny of the sun to fruition. I appreciate your concern. But Sarah, remember... No, I will come and get you out. Yes, I'll keep her. I'll keep her safe, whatever the hell she's doing. Uh, oh well, I can't bother to get my soul back. Uh, yep. So, what depends? How can I uh, get it back? Does it even tell me how to get it back? Oh yeah, it does. Uh. Well, may as well make my way back. I might be able to retrieve my soul gem in the process. That seems to contain my scroll. I may as well chill in the soul can for a bit and just pick up all my, uh, well, get my soul back. Uh, you could say I'm soulless. I may be a, oh God, no. Okay. I believe in civility amongst my claws have rendered the flesh of innumerable foes. But I, I therefore honor name you, Quanarin, or vanquish your word. My desire to speak with you was born from the... I merely wish to respectfully ask for countless years... Before this, I roamed the skies above Tamriel. I fear that my time here has taken its toll upon me. If I ventured far from the soul care, my strength would begin to wane until I... I will place my name with you and grant you the right to call my name from... Do me this simple honor, and I will fight at your side as your grazi mark. Trivial in your mind, perhaps. I don't require an answer, Quindari. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is right. That may actually be very useful, actually. New shouts, kiss. Cool. Uh, do I have to unlock it? Yes. Wow. That may actually be very useful. Uh, right, so I have now learned to be able to call a shout, well, call a dragon to my aid. Uh, I have no idea how long it's going to take for me to get to this place I need to. Uh... But I'm going to, right on. Yeah, right. I'm just going to end it here. Uh, do I don't need to repeat myself. You do what you need to do. I'll do what I need to do. Uh, I will go to episode 18. Then that will be it from me today. Uh, well, recording wise, I'll just get to editing. Uh, all right, guys. Uh, like I said, do what you do, and I'll do what I do. All right, guys. See you. Bye.